Hey guys, I'm Dan and welcome to the basement Dino Dungeon. Okay, so today we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six different Takara Tomi baby animals to add to our collection. Okay, if you take a look at this box right here, it basically contains every single figure of our Takara Tomi baby animals collection. Okay, so we have six of them to add to our collection. I'm very excited about this. So let's get started. All right, guys, so let's begin, okay? So we'll take a look at the six new hatchlings right here. And after that, we'll take a look at our entire collection over here. We'll place all of them right here on the table. So these are basically new figures that, you know, I've been waiting for. And um, yeah, they were actually sent to me by a Dan Safarian. So just want to say a huge thank you to Jonathan for, you know, sending us this um, very cool figure. So let's have a look at the first one, which is a hippopotamus calf so you can see this is a very cute little hippopotamus it has a movable upper jaw so you can see the hippopotamus is actually able to move or open its jaw to a very very wide angle yep very cute little hippopotamus really well done let's see when um this was actually produced it doesn't have the um date but it says vietnam right below so this figure was actually created and um, made in vietnam all right, next figure, let's have a look at this. So we have a little tiger cop. Looks very cute and adorable, super cute. All right, you can see um, it has a movable head. You can rotate it. The legs can't be moved. And I like how they have painted, you know, the body. You can see like, you know, detailing done on the fur, which is very different from our previous um, mini tiger. We'll have a look at, um, you know, at our previous tiger minifigure later on and do a comparison. Next, we have, you know, seems to be an igloo. And this is a polar bear. Yep, a polar bear cop. You can see the head is able to rotate. So similarly, it also has, um, you know, vid, mid in Vietnam written right below. Very cute little polar bear. Next, let's have a look at this one, which is a brown one. And you can see leaves on top. So let's see what this is. Okay, it seems to be a monkey. I think this could be a Japanese monkey. So for this figure, you're able to move the legs. The tail can't be moved. Um, the, there's no articulation on the head. Very cute little monkey, baby monkey. Next, the green one. It's a zebra. A zebra calf, very, very cute little, or zebra foal, I would say. So, yep, you are able to move the neck. And it seems to be a little bit yellowish when it comes to the paint scheme. It's not like pure white. Pretty nice, I would say. You can see like very fine detailing done on the um, fur. Even the tail, you're able to find like, you know, strands of fur on it, which is quite, kind of cool. Next, we have the blue one, which is a... Yeah, this is super adorable. What is this? It could be a spotted seal pup. Yep, it is a spotted seal pup, I think. Okay, so we have six new, you know, baby animals. And right here, we have a box which we have a ton of um, baby animals inside. So let's have a look, okay? So let me just put this on right here first. There's a little latch for you to just push it down like this, which is very cute. So we can put this on right here. Let's have a look. Okay, this is perhaps not a baby animal, so I think this one has to go into our, you know, adult animals collection of Takara Tomi. So let me just place this on right here. Let's see what else we've got. We have a Shiba Inu. It should be in the adult box as well. And this is a little calf, a cow calf. Super cute and adorable, comes with a movable neck. Okay, let's place this one right here. Next. We have a small little, um, what is this? Meerkat? I think so. I think it's a meerkat. And this is an otter, which we should put in our adults, you know, Takara Tomi animals collection as well. And here is a very cute little baby panda. So you're able to move the head. Panda cop. Super cute. All of these animals are super cute. This one seems to be a raccoon. Has a movable head. The tail can be moved. You can see, 
you know, the detailing done on these figures are just amazing. Love them. And we have a brown bear, super cute and adorable brown bear, standing on two legs. All right, let's see what else we've got. We've got a capybara, a baby capybara. All right. Next, we have a Calico Cat. So Calico Cat is basically a name for a color. So if you find like, you know, like orange spots and black spots, gray spots, this is basically the Calico Cat. Beautiful. And here we have our Snowy Hour, I think. And this one, it should be placed in the adult collection box as well. And do you guys know that the, the hour is able to turn its head to like 270 degrees, almost a full turn. Super, super amazing, I would say. Next, we have a very, very cute little lion cop. So you can see it doesn't have any articulation. And uh, if you do a comparison with this one, you can see, you know, both are super cute and adorable. Okay, let's see what else we've got. This is a Fennec Fox, I think. Also comes with a movable head. You're able to move it up and down. Beautiful. And you can see very fine detailing done on this figure. Next, another meerkat. This is an adult version. That's for sure. And here we have a sea lion. Beautiful sea lion. Snowy hour. Snowy hour, you know, along with this hour right here, they should be placed in the um, Takara Tomi Adult Animals collection. And here we have a little piglet. Super beautiful. <laughs> yeah, super adorable. Comes with a movable head as well. And here I think we have a penguin, African penguin if I'm not wrong. Comes with our movable flippers. Next, we have a baby turtle. Alright. Oh, and this is the capybara. So capybara, they are actually known to be very sociable animals. They can get along very well with a lot of other animals. And I think this is a sheep, a lamb. Very nice. This is a big one. This one, I think it should be a raccoon. It comes with a movable tail. You can see the stripes on his tail. Oh, why do we, why do we have this? Infant. <laughs> yep. So I think this is part of the um, Takara Tomi Babies collection. We have a squirrel. Comes with a movable head. You can see the arms are actually, you know, posed like a cradle. So this is basically for it to hold like an acorn. Baby elephant, super adorable. You can see the baby elephant doesn't have any task. So the elephants will only have task when they grow up. And here's a baby red panda. Beautiful. Comes with a movable tail as well as a movable head. A rabbit, super adorable. And this is an otter. Comes with a movable tail, can move it up and down, can rotate it. How do we put this? I think we have to put this lying down. And here we have a gorilla, nice. A baby gorilla. You can see the arms are able to move and the hind legs as well. So when they grow up, the male ones will be known as silverback gorillas. Next, we have a fawn. Fawn is basically our baby deer. So do you guys remember Bambi? It looks like Bambi. Beautiful. Oh, what is this? I can't remember the name. So if you guys know what animal this is, please let me know down below. It comes with a movable tail. It looks like an anteater. The face definitely looks like an anteater. Very long and narrow snout. Baby Pandar. Pandar used to be critically endangered, but I think there's there were a lot of conservational effort. And right now the population is um starting to 
increase, but they're still not in the safe region yet. Oh, what is this? Can't really tell. It looks like a baby otter. <coughs> Next, baby penguin. Very cute. This is a emperor penguin chick. So when they grow up, they'll be known as emperor penguins, which is the largest species of penguins around. All right, and here we have another um, lion cop. You can see it looks so super adorable. And a fox, baby fox. Super cute. Another um, spotted seal pup. Yep. And here we have a pygmy hippo calf. So these hippos are actually different from the hippos that we usually know. So pygmy hippos can be found in Southeast Asia. Giraffe calf. So you can see the giraffe is like resting. It has a very long neck. Oh, this is the rock hopper penguin. You can easily recognize it by its hairstyle. I call this, the, you know, the yellow feathers, the hairstyle. It looks very, very stylish, I would say. Now you better move the flippers. Let's see what else we've got. This is a pig, a piglet. Not exactly sure what is the exact species of this pig. Emperor penguin. I don't think this is um, a baby. It's just a small figure. Calico cat. And this cat is like smiling and um, resting. Very cute and adorable. Um, Seems to be a raccoon. Not exactly very sure, but it could be. And here we have um, a dog. Seems to be a Shiba Inu as well. And this one should be a porcupine, baby porcupine. So, you know, porcupines, they are able to sort of like spread out their spikes to deter predators. I've actually seen a porcupine fighting off a lion with his spikes. A shark, a baby shark. It's not exactly a baby shark because this was actually, um, you know, a small little figure that came along with a megalodon figure. It was to do the size comparison. And here we seems to have, it seems to be a cervell, a baby cervell, could be. Let's see what else we've got, another rabbit. We have a sloth, you can see, this is a baby sloth. And sloth are very, very slow moving animals, which is why they often f fall to, um, you know, Predators, and here is another baby otter. Um, Shiba Inu puppy, super cute and adorable. This is the adult version, and this is the puppy. You can see the puppy; it's um fluffier, I would say. Looks a little bit chubbier as well. Super cute. Penguin. Doesn't look like a baby penguin. And here we have another porcupine, or it could be a hedgehog. Comes with a movable head. I love the Takara Tomi figures because you can see it has very fine detailing and the paint scheme is, um, the paint application is actually very spot on. Very good. Let's see what else we've got. Another pygmy hippo. Pygmy hippo calf. Baby pygmy hippo. Let's see what else we've got. Oh, we've got a, um, Deshawn, which is a dog. Not exactly a puppy, I would say. And not a cat. I don't think it's a kitten. And a rabbit. Nice. Oh, we've got some chicks. Super cute, adorable chicks. And not a pygmy hippo calf. Let's do a comparison. Oh, sorry, this is not a pygmy hippo. This is actually a hippo calf. So you can see, um, they actually look quite different to the pygmy hippos. Yeah, pygmy hippos are much smaller than the hippos that you can find in Africa. Red panda, red panda cop. 
Super cute and adorable. This should be... Wow, what is this? Is this like a rock hopper penguin? I think so. Emperor penguin cheek. Definitely. And here we have a baby monkey. I think this is a baby Japanese monkey. Um, this is a Joey. Joey is basically the name of a baby kangaroo. And it comes with movable legs, I think. But I'm not able to adjust it. Oh, there you go. It was stuck. So let's try to uh, move this one as well. Yes, yeah, very tight. Yep, baby kangaroo. Very nice. It's not really able to stand. Okay. We've got a couple of figures left. And here we have a poodle puppy. Comes with a movable head. Nice. Just a few more figures. Another baby penguin. Okay, tiger cop. Let's do a comparison of the previous one. So this one, it's more in a playful manner, I would say. And this one, wow, this one looks super adorable. The eyes are so huge. This was made in um, China, and this one is in Vietnam. So yeah, different series, I would say. But both the quality are actually very good. You're able to rotate the head, move them up and down. It's quite nice. Very nice. Um, got a fish and this is a lion carp and you can see this li little little lion is just like roaring practicing his roar you know just like lion king simba and this is um red panda our last figure is actually a baby otter okay guys so yeah this is basically my Takara Tomi Animals, Baby Animals Collection. Do you guys like it? Let me know down below, okay? Alright, I will see you guys in the next one. The next video, we will probably do a Wildcats collection because we haven't done it for quite some time. So I would love to show you guys my collection of um, Wildcats, like lions, tigers, cheetahs, jaguars, okay? So let me know down below what other collection video you guys want me to make. I'll be happy to do it, okay? I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.